Strength Fit 1. This is the jumpsuit, please excuse my belly, uh, with the mesh and the waterfall cardigan. So again, this was just from a charity shop. The mesh top was from Simply B. And the cardigan was from a company called Terminal D in Camden Market. The belt is a plain belt apart from this chain piece. This came from ASOS and you can move this to wherever you would like it. I quite like it there. The bag is Killstar. This is the Luxe handbag. And if I can show you the shoes, we have this lovely pair of studded, just simple heeled boots. So this is a look I would wear to work. I would quite happily wear this to a meeting if my customers were happy with my tattoos on show. Um, quite a summery outfit as well because of the mesh. Excuse me while I get the cat out of the way. But this is the outfit and I just put my hair up in a bun because I do find that certainly for corporate looks that looks a bit better. I'm lucky I'm in a job where I can wear my hair down. And then at the necklace I've kept it quite simple. This is my Scarlet and Chains Ank Choker and the makeup. So that's outfit number one. So here we are with outfit number two. So this is the top and skirt combination with the blazer. So this is that lovely, you can now see it now I'm wearing it a bit more, that lovely lace yoke detail. I'm not wearing anything underneath this, this is actually part of the t-shirt, so the lace yoke does come down onto the black fabric. This is the pencil skirt with the leather strip, just to give it that juxtaposition between lace and leather, which we all love. My blazer. And on the bottom, I've just put some tights and my little witch boots. They are a plain, simple, two and a half inch heel um, boot, basically, not too shiny. And we've paired it with this one. This is the Book of Shadows bag by Killstar. And because I haven't got any necklace or anything on this one, because I think it takes away, I can go a little bit more overkill with my bag and give a little bit more detail in that one. Hair and makeup still the same because it's too hot for your girl to be changing it between outfits. I'm sorry. So yeah, that's that one. I will show you very quickly with the blazer done up. It's a little bit hot for this today. Storm Dennis has brought a little bit of warm weather with him today, I think. So that's the blazer done up. It does have a tie here, but I can't be bothered. So if it was a bit chilly or you felt like you needed to do this one up, then you can. Um, I also tend to push my sleeves up, but if you wanted the look with the sleeves, if you had to cover tattoos for a meeting, which it happens, then you have that look. I do prefer this open. Um, just because this blazer is quite warm. But there we go. I will show you the back of the outfit as well. The only thing I will say about pencil skirts is remember they can be quite restrictive. This one doesn't have a massive amount of lift. So getting in and out of the car and stairs can sometimes be a problem. But there you go, corporate outfit number two. So here we are with outfit number three. So this is the plain, simple dress. It's a nice, quite short sleeve one. I'll just pop my arm out there to show you. Um, from Evans, very simple. I think it cost me about £20. The cardigan is just from Primark. The belt, just to, because this is so simple, I thought we'd add some fairly good accessories. So we'll start at the top. This is by Witches Brew Crafts. And this is one of her beautiful back chokers. Thank you, Katie. I adore it. The belt is from ASOS Curve, about £15. Just sets off nicely and gives a little bit of something extra. It's got these lovely domed um, studs and eyelets that you can poke your finger through, which you use as the belt loops. On the bottom, I have my Killstar Gaia boots, proving you can wear Killstar boots to work. And this is the Restyle Bat Satchel which just about fits my laptop and anything else. So this is another good meeting bag. It's very gothic without being over the top and it matches my bat necklace. So that is the very simple outfit number three. 
very corporate. I'd be quite happy walking into any customer that I have from a school to a uh, lawyer's chambers, which is pretty much what we cover. And I do love this outfit. I think it's absolutely awesome. The boots are very, very comfortable. It's very easy to wear. And that's the back. Do a wiggle because I can. And that is outfit three. So this is outfit four. Um, just proving that you can wear Kill Star on New Rock to work and not get in trouble. So this is, of course, the gorgeous cathedral dress. It is short. On me, it is made of that lovely 90s fabric, like you had school trousers that keeps riding up. But if I pair it with this duster coat, it keeps everything quite corporate. I would not wear tights with this. I would wear leggings um, purely because I have leg tattoos and fat thighs and I don't like to show them off. However, for the purposes of today, we have tights. At the bottom, we have a pair of new rocks you've not yet seen. These are my heels. Um, they are new. Excuse me while I put my foot up there so I don't fall. They're clean on the bottom. So they have the new rock emblem on the back of the heel. I have changed the laces out for ribbons. Just because I think it gives it a better look on the shoe. Um, but yeah, they look quite cute. Excuse my thighs. Here we go. So I have paired this quite simply with... This, which is the Crypt of Curiosities Black Rose Cameo. And I like the fact that it's black on white, which gives it a nice effect with the collar. And just to make sure that this doesn't look like a nun, I've teamed it with my Nemesis Now. Uh, no, it's not. It's by World of 3D. I do apologise. But it's the Nemesis Now. Uh, Nevermore Raven on the skull. Excuse the light across it, it is 3D, so it's quite, there we go, it's quite shiny. But again, paired with this, for work, I don't see a problem at all. Again, like I said, I would normally wear leggings. That's just my preference if you wanted to wear tights or if this dress doesn't sit quite so high on you, then I'm sure tights would be fine. So there we go, there is the outfit with the duster coat. It also floats lovely, this coat, I do love it. And again, the makeup's the same. So, hope you enjoyed this. Um, this is part three of the Corporate Goth Alternative series. If you have any other ideas of what you would like me to do, any other fashion ones, any other mini series on whatever you would like, please let me know in the comments below. And until then, as always, beautiful ravens are shown here. Stay beautiful.